Hello, Vision Media. Subscribe now or you killing yourself. Kill him, daddy, kill him. Kill him, daddy, kill him. When you learn how to use motherfuckers' name, because basically what it is is the brand that they use. So when you learn certain, like, okay, you just put that in the budget. It's like, okay, I'm going to give you the 500 but I already got these people to line up so and so and so and so. Because the more, I, and that's just something that started happening with this rap shit. Even a little bit after the reign of Bad Boy. Because the labels didn't have to develop. And labels have never been good at developing this music anyway. Because they don't know what this shit is. I know for a fact that them dudes, that they good dudes, and they from around the way, but they don't happen to rhyme. And they'll get somebody that's talented in the office, and because they were associated or they're around certain shit, they'd be like, yo, take this album and study this shit and come back. And hand them Biggie album or hand them J album. What the? That has nothing to do. You're not helping this dude. You have to find who this person is, which means that you gotta put the person in the studio. Okay, you can see if certain shit is worth it or not. Mm -hmm. Start working them. Okay, his sound is more this. His sound is because if you're gonna put certain people together, the sound has to. Everything has to be. The package has to be there. Right. You know what I'm saying? You can't just get a dude with rhyming ability and put him out there and think that okay, well if he catch he catch because like I said, all they know is that this shit earns money, but they don't know how this shit works. Because if you hand me Jay's album and tell me to go home and study. And come back to you, that means I basically gotta come back and right. sound like him to right. you. Right, 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 right. So that means when I see Jay in the club <laughs> and my record blows up and I sound like him, if he was to come over to me and be like, yo, dude, get off my dick. <laughs> the exec, them dudes don't care about that shit. <laughs> they, don't they don't care about none of that. They, like I said, there's so many different layers that come along with working. You know, when I was a little dude, I used to be like, I used to think about that type of shit, yo. Like, yo, if I'm rhymed, though, I don't even, I want to make it where no dude could come up to me like, yo, you sound like me, right? Nah. I'd rather have a dude be stuck with either he know I sound different and don't know where it's coming from, or he don't, I sound I'm different and he don't like it. I'm going to tell you this now. When I first heard you ever, like, my mom was just like, who the fuck is this? <laughs> it's like, yo, I couldn't wait to see you. I thought you was a big yeah, like six eight. Niggas think I'm a green mile. <laughs> right. <laughs> I thought you was going to be this big. I was like, this dude, yeah. he sound like he's about to yeah. take over the planet and shit. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. That was one of the things that one day this dude came to me and was like, yo, son, nigga, stop me in the street about you today. I was like, where are you? He's like, yo, man, what's up with that nigga, Lord, that person? So, yo, man, this nigga rhyme like he got his own country or some shit, son. This nigga's yeah. like, I told a comedian. I'm like, <laughs> crazy. I'm like, dog, like, for, for somebody to think, for you to give somebody something where they think that you rhyme like you got your own country. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, I, I, I don't like, I, I was, at that time, you was definitely a standout. I used to wait till everybody rhyme on Flip Moment to get to you and be like, at the radio like this. Like. You know, it's like. Yeah, yeah. It was a different approach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. At that time, and uh, you know that that's also the era of like it's different now because you want to go first on the record because they don't play the whole record. Oh, right. Yeah, they exactly. just play the front piece. Right. But back then, that's when <laughs> you get the anchor man spot. That's why Sticky goes last on all the Onyx records. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and, and, and you know, Boss went last with leaders a lot of the times and right. shit like that. But you know, like I said as people listen to shit different, things change, but, you know, like I said, man, they, Everything now is, is more visual. They don't give a fuck about how you sound. Yeah. They just want to see how, what fucking sneakers you got on, you know what I'm saying? And it's all the checks. Like I said, yeah. I could make somebody into a rapper in probably two years. Mm. I'll put some Air Force Ones on you. I'll put a snap back on you now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, 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 I put some... It's like, it's like some skinny it's like a kit you. now. It's like a kit. You know what I mean? You gotta have a kit. You know what I mean? But that's what but you know what though? That's what I was saying too earlier. Like there's reasons and sciences behind why we do what we do. And for you to come here and not respect the fact that okay, these things mean something. It's like you step over shit and just pay. 
to be in. And even when dudes try to skip them steps, you don't win, it don't work that way. Music, period, you gotta earn your way, but with hip hop, you have to earn your stripes, man. It's just, so they create a bunch of disposable people. Right. That, okay, well, if you basically compare new garbage to two week old garbage to last year's garbage, of course you're gonna pick the new garbage. It's just garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe now or you killing yourself. Kill him, daddy, kill him. Kill him, daddy, kill him.